Hey, Global Thinkers. Welcome back to another mind-bending episode of Global Edits, where we unravel the mysteries of paradoxes from around the world. I'm your host Global Edits, and today, we're diving deep into the fascinating world of paradoxes with episode 5, The Barber Paradox. Now, let's talk about the Barber Paradox. Imagine a small town with a barber who shaves all the men who do not shave themselves and only those men. The paradox arises when we ask the question, who shaves the barber? Seems simple, right? But as we dig deeper, we encounter a logical conundrum. If the barber shaves himself, then he falls into the category of men who shave themselves, contradicting the rule that he only shaves those who do not shave themselves. On the other hand, if he doesn't shave himself, then according to the rule, he should be shaved by the barber. It's a loop of contradictions that challenges our understanding of self-reference. The barber paradox highlights the complexity and ambiguity that arises from self-reference in logical systems. It's a bit like looking into a mirror facing another mirror infinitely reflective and mind-boggling. Now, let's explore the historical significance of the barber paradox. This paradox was formulated by the British mathematician and philosopher, Bertrand Russell, in 1901. Russell introduced this paradox to expose the foundational issues within set theory, a branch of mathematical logic. The Barber paradox played a crucial role in the development of modern logic and set theory, leading to Russell's famous Russell's paradox, which questioned the logical foundations of mathematics itself. So, is there a way out of this paradox? Several alternative resolutions have been proposed by logicians over the years. One approach is to reject the assumption that there must be a definite answer to the question of whether the barber shaves himself. This idea aligns with the concept of incompleteness in logical systems. Another resolution involves redefining the concept of sets and self-reference in a more nuanced way. Mathematicians and philosophers continue to explore these alternative paths, pushing the boundaries of our understanding of logic and paradoxes. And there you have it, global thinkers. The Barber Parado, a perplexing journey into the world of self-reference and logical puzzles. If you enjoyed this episode, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more mind-bending content. Until next time, keep questioning, keep exploring, and keep editing the global perspective. This is Global Edits signing off.